So on the robot we have each one of these down here is a color sensor which was used to detect the different colors of lines like red for a stop sign or white and yellow for roads and school zones respectively. Then it also has the sonar sensor here which we made the robot's head essentially and it can measure distance in front of it telling the robot if there's something in front of it like another robot or a building and if there is we've programmed it so that it stops and waits for said object to get out of the way. And then it's got two motors on either side for maneuverability and the main component here is essentially the brain which controls the entire functions of the robot based on our programming. Oh yeah, and the back wheel is actually a ball bearing. That way, if our robot pivots to turn, no matter where it turns, it can't get stuck on a wheel. So it's always able to move in any direction. Cool. So. And then the tail has no functionality, but it looks really cool.